Today we have another entry into the collaboration between Carl M. Jenks Poetry Corner and Bespoke Vocals. More about how to sign up for Carl's weekly essay letter on poetry after the poem. Personal Poem by Frank O'Hara Now when I walk around at lunchtime, I have only two charms in my pocket. An old Roman coin Mike Kanemitsu gave me, and a bald head that broke off a packing case when I was in Madrid. The others never brought me too much luck, though they did help keep me in New York, against coercion. But now I'm happy for a time and interested. I walk through the luminous humidity, passing the House of Seagram with its wet and its loungers and the construction to the left that closed the sidewalk. If I ever get to be a construction worker, I'd like to have a silver hat, please, and get to Moriarty's where I wait for Leroy and hear who wants to be a mover and shaker. The last five years, my batting average is 0.16. That's that. And Leroy comes in and tells me Miles Davis was clubbed 12 times last night outside Birdland by a cop. A lady asks us for a nickel for a terrible disease, but we don't give her one. We don't like terrible diseases. Then we go eat some fish and some ale. It's cool but crowded. We don't like Lionel Trilling, we decide. We like Don Allen. We don't like Henry James so much. We like Herman Melville. We don't want to be in the Poets' Walk in San Francisco. Even we just want to be rich and walk on girders in our silver hats. I wonder if one person out of the eight million is thinking of me as I shake hands with Leroy and buy a strap for my wristwatch and go back to work. Happy at the thought? Possibly so. Personal Poem by Frank O'Hara You can sign up for Carl's weekly essay letter on poetry this week featuring this poem and poet uh, at carlmjenkspoetrycorner.com Use the links. Please give me a like, a share, a subscribe, blah, blah, blah. I will see you tomorrow.